an adult playground. Come and check it out. We've got wine, we've got beer, we've got food, you've got area to have uh, a nice uh, concert when we get those going. Canada's first wine village officially opened up on July 1st in Oliver with six wineries, one brewery and an eatery open to enjoy. A total of 16 buildings will eventually be finished around the courtyard. Well, it's a very exciting day for us. There's been a lot of lead up to being here and finally opening up the gates. Um, we're just thrilled to finally see people here and um, there's a sense of relief as well. It's amazing being a part of this community. It's a bunch of like-minded people all together and we're here to support one another and to make these businesses grow. So you can't be anything but thrilled. Absolutely awesome. Like we were waiting so long uh, for this to happen. Uh, and so we were open, there was a soft opening on the 17th June and ever since people were coming and they were curious to find out what's going on here and everybody was happy so far. Everybody really liked the atmosphere, everybody liked the feeling over here, the small artisan producers doing their best to produce the best wine possible. The anticipation on opening was clear as buildings slowly neared completion. It's been hard to miss on the side of the highway when you've been driving by and even for myself I've been watching very very carefully and as you see each little building go up it gets more and more exciting so I think there definitely has been. Everyone that I've talked to whether it be my friends and family have already heard about it so finally opening those doors and being able to welcome people here is just such a great feeling and we're so excited to see everyone here too. Also with restrictions being lifted we get to welcome more people so how fantastic is that? The community loves it and I think it's the best thing for, for Oliver itself. It's just going to bring people down here and uh, we've got a lot of uh, local employees. To help with opening during a heat wave, the Wine Village brought in snow machines from Apex Mountain to help keep everyone cool. So I think this was the coolest place in the valley. Everybody is super happy. Everybody liked the idea uh, that they don't have to drive from winery to winery. They can park their car or they can take a shuttle bus uh, to the village and they, they can try, for example, in the morning white, all whites in all the wineries, then have a little lunch and then continue with all the reds in the afternoon and, you know, beautiful day after us, right? Most of the buildings will be fully operating by the fall and the Wine Village is open 11 a.m. till 7 p.m. seven days a week. For Castanet News in Oliver, I'm Casey Richardson.